What's happening everybody? Welcome back to Steve's Random Stuff. Hey, today I'm out in the garage. I uh, just wanted to share with you a little issue I'm having with my uh, Ionic battery system. Um, first of all, I just want to say it's not the batteries themselves. The batteries have been awesome. Um, I've got the two 50 amp hour 12 volt batteries for my troll motor for 20 volt, 24 volt system and the 125 amp hour battery for the engine and all the other electronics and everything on the boat and um, the problem I'm having is with the, the Ionic charger uh, it's a four bank charger and um, when I got home from the lake yesterday I plugged the system in because I was down below 50 percent which is usually my uh, point of where I recharge and um, checked the batteries a little, little while later and came to find out that bank number three was not charging so um, did some diagnostic works and stuff and check the fuses that are on here for the um, that come from the charger checked all the wiring connections etc um, my last test what I did is I plugged in the charger and I just touched these two wires together the positive and negative just to see if there's any kind of spark and there was not um, so uh, back number three is a dead circuit so because I'm only using three banks of the four, um, I was able to take four and connect it to three or to the battery and, and do away with the bank three of the charger. So uh, everything is running as normal um, and I no longer have that spare bank. It's just um, uh, one, one, two and four instead of one, two and three. So anyways, that is the issue I'm having. I did talk to Ionic um, today about it. The, the chargers only have a one year warranty on them, so I'm well out of the warranty period. Um, I did describe them the problem and they said they haven't really had any problems with the chargers at all. So um, I don't know if it's just an earlier model, maybe the newer ones are better, I don't know. Um, but anyways, um, that's kind of the issue. Um, my batteries, I bought the charger at the same time as the trolling motor batteries, which was in May of 2020. So it's been two years and five months, give or take. Um, I only have 21 cycles on the batteries. Um, and a cycle is every time you charge the batteries when they drop below 80%. So in two years and five months, I've only charged these batteries 21 times. So it's pretty outstanding um, for the batteries. And you know, I use the boat two or three times, sometimes four times a month. Um, year in and you know your month in and month out throughout the year even through the winter so um, Boat gets plenty of use um, But 21 charging cycles with the charger and have to have one of the banks fail. is kind of disappointing. So It is what it is. We move on um, But I just want to share that with you um, If anyone else has had any problems with the chargers, I'd surely like to know about it um, share your experiences the the customer service on the batteries is outstanding if I had a problem with one of the batteries, even after two and a half years, three years, they'll replace it at, at, at no cost. So, um, uh, so the Ionic and Lithium Hub is a, is a great company to deal with and great customer service. So nothing against them. It's just maybe just got a bad uh, a bad unit. But um, we move on and live to fish another day. So thanks for watching, and um, hit the like and subscribe button if you're new to the channel, and um, we'll catch you next time. Have a good one.